Greetings, my friends. So, I'm doing a little bit different. I'm actually on the inside right now. There's a customer in the camper next to us, so I don't want to bother them. So I will show you some stuff on the outside here. Excuse me, here in a minute. This is the 2023 Cougar 33 RLI travel trailer. I will go ahead and tell you about some of the stuff on the outside. Uh, well, I guess pertaining to the outside. I don't know. <laughs> this is different. I'm all messed up here. Um, it's 8,640 pounds, 37 feet, 5 inches, and it sleeps 6 people. It does have 3 slide outs. Um, it's 50 amp service with 2 ACs. One is 15,000 BTUs, the other is 13,500 uh, it is an extended seasons camper, so it's not a full seasons camper, but it is extended season um, because it does have the enclosed heated underbelly, all that good stuff. So let's talk about what we see on the inside since that's where we're standing. Directly to my left, we have our freestanding dinette with table and chairs. They call it a carpetless slide. Technically, it's kind of carpet. It's that indoor, outdoor, like vinyl material. I've had it in my campers. It's super easy to clean and maintain. Nice big tall slide outs in here. I think I said it, but it has three slide outs. You have your theater seats there. You have your jackknife sofa here in the back with storage up above. End tables on both sides with regular and USB charging. That also does turn into a bed. Jackknife sofa. So there's uh, two of your extra sleepers right there. And those would be nightstands at that time. Oh, let me back up real quick. I do want to point out that it does have the domed roof in it, which I really like in the campers. A lot of them are doing that now. Just gives it that little extra headroom in here, makes it feel a little bit bigger. Directly across from all of your seating, you've got your nice big, I think that's a 55 inch flat screen TV. Down below that, you have your 5,500 BTU electric only fireplace. So you're not using your propane. Definitely will take the chill out of the vast majority of this camper. Um, great early seasons, late season camping would be perfect if you were out camping right now. Up there above, next to the two cabinets, you've got your Bluetooth CD DVD player that will control your inside and your outside speakers. Kitchen, we've got a 21 inch oven. Uh, I think it's three burner. Yep, three burner stove, microwave, nice big kitchen island, massive kitchen island with 50-50 stainless steel sink, detachable chef sprayer, and as you see, you've got quite a bit of cabinets and drawers down below the island as well as on both sides of your stove. You've got, let's see, 10.4 cubic inch fridge freezer. Plenty of room for all of your grocery needs. And you also have a nice big pantry over here that you can utilize for your dry goods. Or you can store pillows, blankets, all that good stuff there if you wanted. Breakfast nook area. Perfect for a Keurig, uh, margarita maker, whatever. Storage up above, storage down below. It does have the in-command system in it. So this is where you basically control, oh look, if you ever get a brand new unit, the code is always four zero. So from the in command, I have a video on full in command, but you can control everything from here. You can control your lights, you can control your awning, your slides, your HVAC. What's really also cool, it does have a mobile app, so you can control it from your mobile app. Um, basically, if you need to run the slide outs out and you're by yourself, you can do it from your mobile app. I'm not going to lie. I have been sitting in my seat and turned the heat up in my camper via the phone rather than to get up. <laughs> not going to lie. Camping is all about relaxing. So why not relax in every facet of it? That's what I say. Um, as we work our way up towards the front of the camper, we have... Porcelain toilet here in the bathroom, so that means you can use any of your cleaning chemicals you want on that. Nice big storage area, super deep uh, for basically towels, toiletries, whatever you need it. And you can put an all-in-one 
uh, washer dryer system in here if you like, which is not a common feature in travel trailers. Super nice. My wife and I, we actually have a washer only, and then we dry on a rack that hooks to our rear bumper. We don't have this model, but we have a uh, washer dryer hookup. So we have the washer only. This would be perfect for that, especially if you plan on going on like week-long trips in this, your vacations. Nice tall stand-up shower with the moonroof in it. You've got your uh, vent fan in here to take out the steam and the stink. Medicine cabinet with storage. Sink, nice size ki uh, kitchen sink, bathroom sink. <laughs> You've got storage underneath your bathroom sink. It's just one of those days, I think. I'd like to blame it on Monday, but it's not Monday. Another feature besides washer dryer hookup that I love in this unit because it's a travel trailer is a king bed. Fantastic feature. King bed. You do have uh, storage on both sides up above the bed. Blackout shades on both. So you're not going to have to worry about being woken up at night. You do have USB as well as regular charging ports on both sides of the bed. A nice big closet with hanging storage as well as stacking storage up there. I said this has a second ADC. It has the option for a second AC. My apologies. So it is still 50 amp. Your second AC can go right there if you choose to add one. So directly across from the bed, we've got a bank of drawers here. A place to actually hook your TV, which... You know, I've always had wall-mounted uh, brackets for my TV in my bedroom, and I've never utilized them. We always just set the TV on the bed when we're in transit, and then we put it up on the uh, dresser when we're at the campground. You also have some storage up above there, as you can see. What else can I mention that I don't want to forget while I'm in here? Let's see, there's something else. Oh, I should probably also mention before we go outside, this is a Keystone product. So it does come with Solar Flex 200. That means you're getting a solar panel on top and you're getting the Dragonfly lithium batteries in here. And basically that solar panel will keep your battery charged. So you can run your slides out, you can use your lights, it'll keep your refrigerator going. Um, what's really nice with the Solar Flex package is that it's easily upgradable so it goes all the way up 3300 i think is the package and that's like a full boondocking package but what's great about it is you can upgrade anytime you want and since a lot of the wiring and stuff is already done for you it's going to be cheaper when you do it so i'll show you a couple things on the outside now that they're out of the way You do have a ladder on the back, so it is a fully walkable roof, meaning you can get up there and clean and maintain it anytime you need to. I told you we have three slides, and since we have a campsite slide, you do have an awning here on the campsite slide, as well as a nice big awning up there at the front. You can also see your outside speakers, power tongue jack, uh, power stabilizer jacks, and you have some additional storage up here at the front with your pass-through storage. Also to point out, in command, I get asked this quite a bit. If something were to happen to your screen in the camper and your phone, back behind here, you also have manual controls to like run your slides, stabilizer jacks, awning, all that good stuff. So you don't have to worry about that you'd be stuck at the campground. So there you have it. There is the 2023 Cougar Half Ton 33 RLI.